In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to construct conditional statistics using the CPS data. Set the working directory to the local folder where you have downloaded the CPS data. See the previous video for how to get the data. I'm going to put the link to the previous video from the description. Next, open the DoFile editor. I usually first start with clearing everything. And then let's load the data. And let's follow the same set of lines as in the previous video. So let's first construct the wage from earnings, hours, and week. Then construct the log wage. Today we want to show the conditional statistics of the log wage given some demographic characteristics. We can still use the same sum command as before, followed by if defining the conditioning attributes. Now we get the average log wage for the male subsample. Let's repeat this exercise for the female subsample. Copy and paste this line and change the female indicator value to 1. And now we get the average log wage for the female subsample. So we can now compare the wage between women and men. In fact, we can compare the wage distribution, not just the mean. Again, let's use the k-density command followed by the if, defining the conditioning criterion. Here's the distribution of the log wage for the female subsample. And now, let's repeat this exercise for the man. By default, it can only display one density per time. However, we can overlay one density over the other if we use the add plot option. Type the entire command line inside the pair of parentheses of the add plot option. Here, the baseline density is for women and the added density is for men. We can see the two densities together, but we can be more informative about the two lines we can use the legend function. The first line represents women and the second line represents men. By the way, we need to type three slashes to mean that these two lines in fact represents a single line. Now the density plots are more informative than before. We can next use the race as an additional criterion for more detailed analysis. For example, we can focus on the subsample of white female, but we can add the other plots for the other subsamples. For efficiency of writing, let me copy and paste this line. We can concatenate multiple plots within the add plot option, and they should be separated by two vertical lines. And again, don't forget the triple slashes to mean that we are still working on a single line. And now let's make the four combinations of the conditioning criteria. By the way, in the CPS data, the race value of 1 means white and the race value of 2 means black. Now we see the four density plots displayed together.
again we can add the legend by the legend command. Uh, something is wrong with the legend. My code should be wrong. Uh, we need to give the correct line indices. Now it displays the four density plots with the correct legend.